What's up? Who else see? Squad. So, today's like the same day when I'm posting like the Cooking with Sohima part 11. So, that's why I'm still wearing the same shirt. So, yeah. So, right now, we're this is about to be Cooking with Sohima part 12. So, we are about to be making some... Can y'all see that? We're about to be making some Rice Krispie treats. So what you're basically gonna need is some butter, some marshmallows that I ate, so yeah. Of course, the Rice Krispies, you're going to need some cooking spray. Mine is somewhere up here. Well, somewhere. Oh, here. Here it is. Some cooking spray right here. Oh, and also before I get into this video, I'm about to think, thank y'all for 120 subscribers. You know, you know 200 is on the way. You know, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Sohima101. If you don't want to spell that, S-O-H-E-M-A. Okay, and follow me on my Snapchat at Sohima on Fleet. Okay, so I guess the first thing I'm going to do is spray the pan. Thank Grayson. <clears throat> oh, I feel like nothing is in here. Let <coughs> me cough. Why feel like nothing is coming out? Okay, a little something, something is coming out. Oh, also, comment down below when is, no, what is your zodiac sign? Mine is a Libra, because my birthday is on October 3rd. So yeah, I'm still 12. When I'm in high school, I'll be 13 still for a while. I think that's good. I might put some more later on. Oh, I forgot something. You also, you know, I'm gonna also put vanilla extract in there. I'm gonna go get some right now. Okay, so I actually got the Jamaican one. So yeah. Sorry for the sorry for this vlog. This vlog. Sorry for this cookie video. For being all over the place, but that's when you're not prepared to do a video. You know what? So we're probably gonna need this bowl to like mix it up in. So, so it also gives you instructions on the marshmallows and on the box. So I mean, let's see. Four teaspoons of butter or margarine. Like butter no one. And you also have to microwave that in 45 seconds. Okay. Okay. 
I don't have any margarine, so. And I gotta get a microwave safe bowl to put it in. Okay. And by the way, this these two cooking videos are basically pre-recorded. So you you guys will be seeing the first cooking video on Monday and this one on Wednesday. So butter. I don't even know where I'm putting all these stuff. This is one one half teaspoon, whatever it is. Just it's still about to work, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna need a spoon to take this out and put it in the spoon. Cause I'm pretty sure that's, yeah. Hopefully this is enough butter. If this isn't enough, then I guess oh well. So if so I did make this before but I just didn't record it. I don't even know if I had YouTube if I made it. And hopefully this is enough because we'll see in a minute. I'm gonna put it on 45 seconds. So like I was saying, like I was saying, um, I made this before. It was good, but like it wasn't like the regular, the regular rice crispy treats that you'd be having at the store. It just, it, it wasn't even that sweet. So I don't know why it's popping. Anymore. You know what? Whatever. I'm going to still do it. You know what? I'm going to still do it. That's alright. That's alright. But I don't know why. But hey, I still got the butter. <laughs> I still got the butter. But when this video is done, I have a whole bunch of things to clean up. Well, not not a whole bunch of things to clean up, but like, you know. But also, one good tip. When you're baking or cooking, whatever, it's always good to like, clean up 
always good to like clean up so when you're done you don't have to do all that stuff okay let's get back to the video i talked too much see so you see on this it says something different than that you know, you know, you know. see that says three teaspoons of butter this says four teaspoons I mean, whatever. Add, okay. Butter in a large microwave bowl on high 45 seconds or until melted. Add marshmallows. Toss to coat. Wait. Okay, so they're saying I have to microwave these marshmallows. Okay. You know what, guys? I'll be back because this video is getting way too long. I'll be back. Okay, so I decided that I'm just going to put the butter in, in the pan that I have on the stove right now because... I guess I should listen to the box because the marshmallows had the butter popping in there. So, mm. and now I gotta clean up the mess up in there. So, great. Do not try that. Do not try that recipe at home. Just look on the box. Don't look on the marshmallows because the marshmallows gives me something different. Unless I'm doing something wrong. it's enough butter though I hope so right now wash my hands from the butter right now I'm just about to put the marshmallows in here I don't know how much I'm putting just whatever I guess Okay. okay so in the pan it's like I'm stirring it right now I put like at least two and a half teaspoons of vanilla extract in there because like I said if when you when I made this it tasted good but like it didn't taste like kind of sweet so yeah and they're melting in the saucepan right now Put it on low, and I put some more butter in there just in case because I wasn't sure if I put enough. And they're melting right now. It doesn't even look like it looks like a caramelish color because of the vanilla extract. So yeah. So it says so. This is basically an easy treat, an easy recipe. So, maybe in my next video, I'll make homemade ice cream. Because I made that before. And that was good. Comment down below. Also, comment down below what flavor I should make. And maybe I'll make it. Because I only made vanilla. And vanilla is basic. So, yeah. But comment down below what your favorite kind of ice cream is. And what flavor I should make. Okay, while I'm starting this. Because it's almost done. I'm going to just show y'all what it looks like. It looks like so good. Okay, let me show you. Okay, so that's how it looks like right now. I'm just stirring it up until it's completely done. I mean, like, completely done. So you don't see any marshmallows. Okay, so I'll get back to you when it's done. Bye. Okay. Baby, I the sugar. Okay, phone keeps on dropping. So I also got leftover marshmallows too. The recipe says that you need 48. So yeah. Okay. Okay, so right now y'all can see me. 
but <clears throat> I'm putting the Rice Krispies in here. <clears throat> so yeah. They said that, that, I mean, you can measure it too, but like, I mean, hey, you don't, you don't always have to do all that measuring, so. Yo, I mean, yo basically know, shoot, maybe I should still put this on low or something, I don't know. But I mean, you'll basically know when you stop, I guess. Okay. You hear it popping and stuff in here. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit more more rice krispies and i think i might put a little bit more of vanilla extract so you can actually taste the flavor okay that's me that's just me adding the vanilla extract doesn't say you have to but that's just me okay that's it i don't i really don't want it to be too too sweet so okay mix that up in here it looks like oh it looks like oatmeal. It smells good though. Like, it's hard to stir, but it smells good though. Okay, I'm gonna be back. Like, this video is probably gonna be long. I'm, I'm talking too much. You know what? Okay, <gasps> guys, could y'all see that? Does it look done? I, I, I can't really tell. <laughs> no, I can't really tell. Does it look done? If it looks done to you, I could put it in the pan. Comment hashtag done. Okay, I guess I'm gonna put a little bit more, and I guess that's it. So, <laughs> but for real though, does that really look like oatmeal? Like it doesn't even look like my spicy treats. Okay, some of this is for us. It's for my breakfast too. So, okay, this is good now. This is really good now. So, yeah, I don't. Y'all can make this to. Y'all can make this into balls. Y'all can make this into like rice crispy cake pop. Right Chris rice crispy cake pop. I just thought about that. But I don't have anything to dip it in. I don't have anything to like, you know, put it in. So Okay, so I'm gonna put it in the pan and yeah. Okay. So it's hot, but I'm going to start putting it in the pan right now. Oh, uh-uh. Let me see if I can put some more spray up in here. Put some more spray up in here. Because I'm really not sure if it's... Like, I don't even see no spray on the pan. Like, for real, though. I really don't see any spray on the pan. Oh, oh okay. I got to put my hand on it like this. It looks weird. It says you could put wax paper down too. Let me see. Let me see if I got some wax paper. Okay, so I got some wax paper after all. So this is what wax paper looks like. Just like this. Is that good enough? Sticking. I do not know. Well, it looks ratchet, but I'm still about to put it in there. And since I guess there was stuff coming out of the um, thing, I guess like, yeah. Uh, it smells so good right now. It smells so good, y'all. Comment down below if you made homemade Rice Krispie treats before. 
and these are homemade i i looked at the recipe a little bit but like the vanilla extract is like my like my little touch on to it because the last time i made it with just marshmallows it was like yeah okay I, i'm gonna be back because this is really getting sticky and stuff okay okay y'all so <sighs> this is how it looks like this is before Some of, some of it is like kind of like not filled in because look at this is how it looks like. It's really sticky and messy. I can barely take it out. So that's what I'm about to do. Let me see what it says though. I have to get some water. Sorry, I'm eating some Doritos. <sighs> You're gonna be hearing lots of smacking noises, but oh wow. And it's gonna be really sticky. But. Okay. Ugh. Okay. So, I'm guessing these are done. I'm going to cut into it. I put them in the fridge because I wasn't really sure if I should, like, if I wasn't sure what I was supposed to do with it, so I just put them in the fridge. I hope they're done because... Uh-uh, they're... Okay. 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 Wow, guys. They're not done. I thought they were done because on the top it's hard, but... Oh, well. Here's a piece. Whatever. Whew. Really sticky. Well, I mean, some parts are them. Some parts are hard. But I guess the part that I have is not that dumb. Let me try. I'm telling you guys. Yeah, it's not going to work. It's not going to work all well. So, yeah, I'm telling you guys. If you make these... If you make this, put vanilla extract in it because it tastes good. Just give it some more flavor because if you just put butter and marshmallows in it, it just won't taste that sweet, you know. Okay. This is really good. Okay, enough of that. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Okay. Um. Yeah. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Follow my social media. Yeah.